Hi, I'm here with Liza Minnelli. Liza. Hi. <laughs> Hi, I'm here with Liza Minnelli. Oh, thank you. Hi, I'm here with Liza Minnelli. Liza. Yes. Hi, I'm here with Liza Minnelli. Liza. One ton. Hi, I'm Jessica Kirsten, and this is like the biggest day of my career. I am here. I am interviewing my idol, Liza Minnelli. Hi, guys. Oh, Liza, thank you so much oh, for doing Thank you so much. I, I have I have so many questions for you. Yes. I, wow. Um, you have been in so many crazy situations in your life. Yes. I, what would you say is the most like exciting situation you've ever been in? Probably when I was a wet nurse at Studio Fifty Four. Oh, wow! Can you? <laughs> Liza, have you ever been in a life or death situation? About 15 times. Wow. I was performing Victor Victoria, and I was on stage, and I slipped, and I slid all the way through the mezzanine, right into the lobby. I went right past the candy man, and straight into traffic. I was run over by six trucks, because no one stopped. And I said, I need my sock! And finally, when I was in the hospital, I said, I'm not going like mama. And I got back in time for the encore. <laughs> that is... <laughs> I got run over that. Oh, the That's candy the man. Candy man. <laughs> I, I slipped through the... <laughs> Past the candy man. <laughs> So I know that you used to go to the clubs a lot. Yes, oh, it was so fun. It was really fun. We, I remember one, I, I was on the dance floor, and I, me and Michael Jackson, who was so funny. People don't know this about Michael, but he was really funny. And we started to dance. And I said, Michael, there's something squishy underneath me and screaming. And he said, that's your sister, Lorna. It was wonderful. So Lorna was, was underneath she you? She was the floor. Wow. <laughs> and she still gets migraines to stay. One time I was little, and it was snowing. And I wanted to be an ice skater, because until I saw Bye Bye Birdie. And my father, Vincent Minnelli, a wonderful director at MGM Studios, Liza, there's an ice rink outside. And I said, oh, thank you, Dad. I went outside, and I started to skate. And I said, Daddy, this ice is lumpy and screaming. He said, that's your sister, Lorna. It's... <laughs> Hi, I'm here with Liza Minnelli. Liza. Hi. I was at my friend Kate Thompson's house, who was my godmother. And she was so funny. She was really funny. And I remember one time we were at a dinner, and there was a bunch of people, and topics would go around, and people would comment. And this one actor, and she didn't like, kept saying, well, I don't know anything about that. Finally, we got to acting. And he got to him and he said, I don't know anything about that. And Kate Thompson was smoking a cigarette. Only I could hear her said, evidently. I mean, I just... Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, guys. I'm here with Liza Minnelli. Liza, I'm curious. What do you eat for breakfast? God bless <laughs> America. Land that I love. Stand beside her and guide her. Oh, God bless! A chicken. Wow. <laughs> God bless! A chicken. <laughs> Lisha, what's your favorite lunch you've ever had? Well, I was on a boat with Fidel Castro in 1977. It was me, 
Red Buttons, Charles Alshnevach, Rosemary Clooney, and Sammy Davis Jr., and Gene Kelly, who I called Uncle Gene, and we were sharing tea, and Fidel was cooking hot dogs. It was wonderful. What? So <laughs> <great>. <laughs> you look insane. Can you imagine that we're professionals and people hire us? I know. <laughs> I have four children. I was going to say, you're a mother. <laughs> Comics never grow up. Comedians never. never grow I'm a child. Up. Okay. All right. <laughs> I have to become her. We both don't look at the person when we talk to I them. I know, I'm looking here and you're looking here. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wait, I have to be serious. Okay, okay, go ahead, go ahead. <laughs>